Well, Governor DeSantis is ordering colleges to shut down a pro-Palestinian student group. Florida now the first state to outlaw the Students for Justice in Palestine organization. Eight on your side, Beth Rousseau, joining us live this morning with the reason the DeSantis administration is making this move. Beth. Hey, Avery, so we know that there are at least two active chapters of this organization on campuses here in the state of Florida, that one of them is here at the University of South Florida. What I want to do right now is go ahead and pull up that memo that was sent out by Chancellor Ray Rodriguez with the university system. Now it orders the chapters of National Students for Justice in Palestine to be deactivated. He says the national group released a toolkit saying Palestinian students in exile are part of this movement, not in solidarity with this movement, referring to the Hamas attack that has killed 1,400 Israelis and 31 American citizens. According to the chancellor, it's a felony to knowingly provide material support to a designated foreign terror organization, so the governor has directed the groups be deactivated at Florida universities. Now, the chancellor says that the two chapters of SJP, which again include the one here at the University of South Florida, can form another organization, but it has to comply with state law as well as policies at the university. This morning, I'm reaching out to the SJP chapter here at USF just to see what their reaction is to the move by the DeSantis administration and what their next step forward are going to be. We're live in Tampa, Beth Russo, 8 on your side.